This week on Avalanche Garage we install on board air. El Cheapo. Hi I am Daddy H, a robot voice from the future. You may remember me from such films as how plum uses are made, and off-roading in Dulzura. This is a low buck eBay special 12 volt compressor. The specs are fairly impressive, with 6.35 CFM nominal flow rate. The maximum continuous operating time is over 40 minutes. The compressor comes with a carry baggie, basic nozzles, and over 20 feet of air hose. The pressure gauge is quite useless and inaccurate. The quick release adapter is standard size. There is a waterproof on off switch and an overheating protection circuit. The compressor is designed to be portable, but we do the right thing and install it in the wrong place. The avalanche has a second battery tray under the bonnet. The location is quite unfriendly to a cheaply built compressor, but we only use it for airing up the tires. The compressor will not run while driving, which should limit the wear and tear. The compressor does not look especially water and dust proof, and we will add some protection later on. We will report back later, how long it works on overlanding trails. We can't bolt it directly on the battery tray, as it would lean on the engine computer mount. We will build a spacer out of a mighty 3 quarter inch red oak board. We reuse the rubber pads for vibration damping. Plenty of clearance all round. We mark the new mounting position with great precision. The oak spacer is mounted to the existing nutserts using 3 quarter inch longer M6 bolts. After skillful carpentry work, we move the final assembly.
That's not going anywhere. I hate wiring, don't you? Of course, both wires are black, and we don't have red heat shrink or electrical tape. Perfect. Heat shrink a day keeps moisture away. For added safety, we reuse the winch cut-off switch. Avalanche garage zip tie moment. The tire is roughly 33 inches. In Avalanche Garage, we don't just install compressors. We put them to a test. Twenty to thirty five PSI takes one minute, forty seconds. 